Hi, I'm Christian Yeh, and this is a tutorial on how to create a Mad Lib, Mad Lib, <laughs> Mad Lib Microsoft's in Microsoft Visual Studios. So, here you got your actual Mad Lib, and it, it I just made a silly little thing, and um, pretty much what this does is it tells the console to write a line and so it tells the console to write a line and then you put um, quotation marks in between or the parentheses and then you write pretty much whatever you want and if you press control F5 this will pop up once you press control 5 and it'll read out whatever is in between the parentheses and pronoun was running they were late for whatever place you want to put in there and then they got fired for being time whatever you want to put 30 minutes late um, so we're gonna start up here and what we're gonna make we're gonna make a string so and then we're gonna list our variables so we're going to put um, uh, pronoun pronoun oh, not dot and uh, place and time so that are that is our variables and next line we're going to actually be making the we're going to do console dot right line see it just pops up for me and in between parentheses we're going to put quotation marks and we're going to write something like um, write a pronoun uh, yep and then we're going to put console so we're going to tell the console to read line which will pause pause the system and um, it will read whatever the guy using the program guy girl whatever um, whoever is using the program and reads what they put in there and um, yeah oh one thing I forgot about is we need to equal the um, the variable here uh, to equal whatever they put. So pronoun. So pronoun is now equal to whatever they put in there. So we're just gonna do that again. Um, or do that top line again console dot right line and we're going to now write write a place and then we're just going to do that with all of these okay so once you got all of that down um it's not finished quite yet but uh, I'll show you guys what we got here. So we got our variables. Um, system will read that. Come down, tell console to write a line, um, or write whatever's in between here, and then it's gonna do the same thing over and over and over again, and assign these. Oh, oh God, nope, not do <laughs> wrong thing. Now we're gonna come down here, and we're going to delete this this is where we need to add whatever the guys say guy girl you know so we're going to add a plus and then we're going to put pronoun so we're going to add the pronoun to was running to our sentence and they were late for a place so oh get rid of that and plus place so you get the gist of it right 
and finally the last one plus time cool right okay so now we're actually done with it we're gonna press control f5 and so we're gonna write a pronoun uh, he uh, write a place uh, work uh, late he was running they were late for work I forgot to put a space in between here I'll fix that afterwards cuz if you don't it'll just end up looking like no spaces <laughs> they were late for work they got fired for being late all right let's fix that quick quickie uh, all you have to do to fix that is just add a space in between here. Boom, bada boom. And then press control 5 again. So, that is the end of the tutorial. Thank you for watching all the way to the end. Please consider subscribing and liking. It means a lot. I'm almost at 100 subscribers. Um, comment if you want more of this, because I will certainly make more. It's... Not that hard to make tutorials, I'm not going to lie. And um, thank you.